Okay, this is a brief tutorial on how to pair the controllers to the lights so that they work through an application. Step one, make sure there is power going to your Wi-Fi controller. If not, you may need to switch the wires. You might have them wired wrong. If that is on and these two have the red lights flashing, that means everything's powered correctly. Now, first things first, open up your tablet or your smartphone, Android or iPhone. So number one, we need to connect to the Wi-Fi that this is broadcasting. So go to your settings, search for in your Wi-Fi, and search for Wi-Fi 104. Click on that, and it should connect. So once you've connected to that Wi-Fi, you're going to come back in. Make sure the Wi-Fi symbol does um, light up, showing that you've connected to the Wi-Fi 104. I now have the Wi-Fi 104 connection. Go to the application. Now you're going to come to a screen like this. First things first is you want to go through and set up to make sure that both of these controllers are currently on there. So, this is controller one, which is this one, or that one. Controller two is the other one. Make sure they're A on RGB, both of these are, and make sure they're linked. That means that it is basically linking these two into the system. Go back. Now, you can see there's one and two is highlighted. That means the two strands of diodes are highlighted. Click on this it comes up to your color palette. At this point we don't have any connectivity between the two so we're going to turn on one RGB1 and I'm going to pair this one to the RGB1. So I'm going to push that just a fast push it's going to beep as you heard push my finger on it and I can control that all I need. Now I need to control the next one push RGB2 push the button and it's in. And now you've got the different strands to be able to do whatever you want. You can turn them off and turn them on. And that is how to program your remotes.